Today I'm going to show you how to create a two-tone, half-tone dot effect on DaVinci Resolve without any plugins. First on the edit page, I'm going to drag my clip onto the timeline and open in Fusion. From there, I'm going to press shift and space and grab myself a brightness and contrast node and connect it to the media. Go to the inspector and bring the saturation all the way down. Then go back to the edit page, drag in a fusion composition, trim to the size of the clip, and open in fusion. Connect a background node to media out and merge another background into the foreground. Go to the inspector and under image uncheck auto resolution and change the resolution to 1920 by 1920. After that go back and change color to white. Then drag in an ellipse mask, change the soft edge to 0.4 and border width to negative 0.05. Then create four copies, add them to your mask, and change the centers of each of them to 0, 0, 0, 1, 1, 1, and 1, 0. Then I'm gonna drag in a transform node, change edges to wrap, and bring the size down to 0 0.009. I'm also gonna add an angle to it, uh, just cause I think it's gonna look nicer. Go back to the edit page, select your fusion composition, and change the composite mode to hard mix. You can see it's already giving the effect I'm looking for, but I'm going to make a few adjustments just to clean it up a little bit. So I'm going to drag an adjustment clip onto my timeline and open in Fusion. Once in Fusion, I'm going to add a blur node and an erode dilate node and connect it to my media. Select the erode dilate node, go to the inspector and bring the amount down slightly. I suggest somewhere between negative 0.0005 and negative 0.0008. Also, make sure you change the filter from box to circle. This is going to make the dots look more like dots. Now head back to the edit page and the next thing I'm going to adjust is the light levels. Because as you can see there's a lot of black which you may prefer but I'm going to change and to make this adjustment I'm going to go back and open my media in Fusion. From there I'm going to select my brightness contrast node and slightly bring up the lift to raise the darks. And to raise the lights I'm going to bring up the gain a little bit. This may take some time getting it just right, but once you're happy with it, head back to the edit page and view the results. Hopefully this tutorial helped you out, and if you have any suggestions on what you want to see next, leave a comment down below, and thanks for watching.